Today's a twofer. Sunday, preach from the mountaintop, November 16th, 2014. <clears throat> James Hendelman here. I want to talk about something that I'm a little bit riled up about. <laughs> I want to talk about being a healer and what that means. There's a lot of people who think that they're a healer and they're in the immature feminine. The feminine is the healing energy and the masculine is the serving energy. Okay. So. <laughs> this is one person in particular. This is for one person in particular. For whom I shall not name. You know who you are. You better watch the whole video too. <clears throat> The masculine energy serves, the feminine energy heals. If the masculine is in the immature, he winds up being a bully. And he will only serve himself. And he won't have space to hear or listen to or check other things, ways out, and um, be single-minded and driven. Which is beautiful, but it's, it's the uh, starting way, it's the beginner's way, it's the beginning way. The immature feminine healer rescues and tries to save people, which weakens them, it supports them in their weakness instead of their strength, and it's codependent and it serves people in their weakness. The immature feminine healer. In fact, the mistakes that most mothers make, wives and mothers make, is they put everybody ahead of themselves and they think that's healing and it's not. It causes the entire family to, it weakens the entire family and eventually the mom will get pissed off. The mature feminine healer supports people in their strength and not their weakness. The mature feminine knows how to wield the powers of the universe. The mature feminine is the portal to the divine, the gateway to heaven. She knows how to call on the powers of the Higgs field to pull in to a sacred space, a healing power by just being and by not doing anything but by creating a space. So you have to recognize and trust the feminine, the mature feminine, not the immature feminine, <laughs> 